last guy who was recording my camera got me actually called him blood. So, you know, he wasn't putting the camera on me. So I said, you know what? I'm paying you all this money. You ain't gonna put the camera on me. Why the hell are you working for me then? So, uh, I messed up again. You know, and the crazy thing is, I got a V10. I didn't want the V10. I wanted the V8. I went to the dealership and said, hey, you know what? I want the V8. Come check this out. So I was blind because the sun out here in Phoenix was blinding my eyes. Now you can see this. Check this out. See how I got the V10 right here? What I think happened was this. This wasn't on there when I bought the car. This was just blank. So now what's going on is I bought, I went up to pick the car. I didn't realize until I went home when it said V10. And I'm like, what the hell is going on? I didn't want the V10. So check this out. Come back here real quick. But what I did want is these carbon fiber. So I didn't know shit about Audi Audis before I went in there. I got the Audi R8, thinking that the R8 meant V8. Didn't know that it meant V10, but check this out though. One thing I didn't notice as well, because they didn't show me this was this. Check this out. Show me back to this engine right here. You know, for all the crazy up badgers. Check this out. V10 FS1. I think they had switched this in on the Audi. I did not want the V10. I had told them I did not want the V10. Put the put the V8 up on this car. Put the camera back on me, girl. Shit. So I had told them I wanted I wanted the V8, not the V10. So now I'm stuck with the Audi R8 V10 that I don't even want. I wanted the R8 V8, not this one. So come over here and check this out. So one of the best parts about this is the inside. The inside is you know regular black you know what i mean i didn't want nothing else because you know i got a corgi i got a corgi and a how's it going hey, how you doing good i got a corgi and a pit bull so i said you know, i need black interior because if i don't have black interior my corgi you know she's got the little feet and shit she the good thing is about this too because i was gonna bring the corgi with me when i go to the dog park is check this out i had went in the car dealership and said <laughs> i went to the car dealership and said this I need a car that my Corgi can jump in. You see my Maserati Levante right there? Put the car on my Maserati Levante. You see that right there? Hell yeah, you already know what it is. Maserati up in this motherfucker. So the thing was, I had put the, uh, I said I need the Corgi to be able to jump in the car with me. Because you know what I'm saying, the Corgi, you know what I mean? Luxury dog, expensive breed, you already know what I'm talking about. I need the Corgi to ride with me. But the thing is, I can't get a tan interior or any color than black. The Corgi, she, she gonna step on it. And the pit bull will step on it as well. So. Now I'm stuck with the Audi R8 V10. And the crazy thing about this is I don't even know how to drive it. I might as well blow out the clutch shit. I already almost blew out the clutch this morning. One of the mugs, I told them when I took the muffin shop, they said, you ain't supposed to do that. You're gonna burn out the clutch in two days. I said, shit, two days? He said, how much? I said, how much is the new clutch gonna cost? Cause I don't even know what the hell it's gonna cost. So give me an idea of how much the clutch is gonna cost. Cause I don't even know how much the clutch is gonna cost. He said, it's gonna cost about $4,000. I said, $4,000? I was like, shit, all I gotta do is buy Taco Bell stock for about 15, 20 grand in the Taco Bell stock when it hits $50 per share. So once it goes back up, shit, you already know what's about to happen. I'm about to make that clutch back. So if I break break down the car, break down the clutch, so be it. If I had bought this car and the clutch only had about God knows how many miles, maybe from here to Chicago and back, if I had busted out the clutch and I had busted out the clutch, at least I could get a new one and run that motherfucker to the ground or something. So yeah, I had just picked this up, Audi. R8, V10, meant to get the V8, but, or maybe, you know, they had up badge the whole car. Now, if you guys want to talk to me about this car, if you guys want to hit me up on Instagram, feel free to hit me up on Instagram, at official Tyler Speedy. You already know what my name is. It's not hard to find out my name. Go ahead and look me up on Google. Also, <laughs> also go ahead and look at my, my uh, YouTube profile. You click on my YouTube profile, because I know a lot of you motherfuckers ain't dumb. Click on my YouTube profile, you'll see my first and last name, just include official in front of that. Search that motherfucker on Instagram. Send me a DM. If you like my videos, subscribe. If you don't like my videos, I don't give a fuck. I don't give a fuck about you. I got the audio, all right? What the fuck you driving for?